Continuing on with the Home Renovation UK series, in this video, we're going to show you the renovation of the kitchen. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please do so now and remember to hit the notification bell. So here we are in the kitchen and let's first remind ourselves what a grungy, horrible looking room this was before we started the renovation. Naturally, one of the first things you're going to do is to strip out uh, all the counters. We actually did this in two different phases. Uh, but also you will see here the kitchen wall. And uh, this is the original kitchen wall to the outside. And we decided to uh, frame this out so as that we could take it back from the original wall. Uh, this large hole that you will have seen is actually the original chimney and we were therefore able to duct out the, S, the extractor fan from the cooker out through this hole. Now unfortunately I don't have a lot of uh, pictures of what happened during the renovation of this kitchen uh, but what we additionally had to do was uh, all the walls were covered in tiles from floor to ceiling, very old, very dirty tiles, stripped off all the tiles, dab and dotted plasterboard on as a process of uh, essentially uh, putting some fixing to plasterboard and then affixing that to the wall. Uh, the coving that was in this particular property was the original coving so it was not the type that you'd be adding to walls today which can be easily removed so we had to build that out so there was infill plaster that had to be done there we had to fit a new kitchen door and when I say kitchen door I'm talking to the outside uh, again this was a non-standard side so you had to be a little bit creative here um, which I can't really illustrate to you unfortunately uh, but it, it essentially what it was was that the uh, the door was taller than the actual frame and so therefore we were because we had framed out the that wall we essentially put the door inside the house uh, and then had to bridge it uh, across on the outside and then tile the floor uh, with ceramic tiles and finally uh, finish it off with uh, the worktop, a wooden worktop and then tile above the, wood, the worktop to give a tiled splashback. Then we changed the lighting from a single pendant to spotlights to give it a modern look and some painting and decorating and now we can have a look at the finished product. Having completed the renovation of the kitchen, in the next video, we're going to tackle the renovation of the bathroom. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please do so now. And remember to hit the notification bell. And please like and share this video with your friends and family.